Hello, and welcome to our second video of the Monkeypox series. There will be a total of three videos in this series, and we'll try to cover everything you need to know in these videos. Monkeypox isn't smallpox, but more like its family member. It is a rare virus that mostly affects people in Central and Western Africa. It has two distinct genetic types that can be distinguished. Since it was first found in 1958, there have been about 11 outbreaks of monkeypox. One of these outbreaks occurred in the United States in 2003. As there is a lot of hype going on about it nowadays, we should know about the basics of this virus. So let's start first with the symptoms. The symptoms of monkeypox are extremely similar to those of the smallpox virus. However, symptoms of monkeypox are typically less severe. It can take anywhere from 5 to 21 days for the first symptoms of monkeypox to show up after an individual has been exposed to the virus. In most circumstances, it takes 7 to 14 days. The early symptoms include fever, followed by headache. Aches and pains in the muscles and back, tiredness, and chills are also minor signs. There can also be lymphadenopathy. Lymphadenopathy refers to a condition in which the lymph nodes become enlarged. After the fever has developed, a rash will typically show up anywhere from one to three days later. In most cases, the parts that are affected by the rash are the face, which is by far the most typical location, the palms of the hands, the soles of the feet, the mouth, the genitalia, and the eyes. In complicated cases, this rash may develop into reddish sores, which will fall off after they have had a chance to dry out and scab over. Most people with monkeypox have symptoms for between two and four weeks before they go away on their own. According to the WHO, infections with monkeypox can sometimes result in severe complications. These complications can include secondary infections leading to inflammation of the air sacs in the lungs, known as bronchop pneumonia, an extreme full-body immune response against the body's own healthy cells and inflammation of the brain, which is called encephalitis. Take these precautions to avoid getting infected with the monkeypox virus and to stop its spread. Stay away from people who have a rash that looks like monkeypox and avoids getting close to them. Avoid coming into contact with clothing, sheets, blankets, or other materials that have been in the possession of an infected person or animal. People who have monkeypox should be kept separate from healthy people. After having any kind of contact with an infected person or animal, you should thoroughly wash your hands with soap and water. Stay away from animals because they could carry the virus. Two examples of smallpox vaccines that also protect against monkeypox are ACAM 2000 and Genios. Because the viruses that cause smallpox and monkeypox are related to one another, these vaccines can be used to protect against monkeypox. People who have been in contact with monkeypox may be told by doctors to get vaccinated against the disease. People who are at a higher risk of being exposed to the virus as a result of their jobs, such as those who work in labs, should also get vaccinated. At this time, vaccination against monkeypox is not recommended for everyone by the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. At this time, there is no treatment that has been specifically approved for infections caused by the monkeypox virus. On the other hand, antivirals that were designed for use in patients with smallpox have a chance of being effective against monkeypox. There are two recognized types of the disease, variola minor, with a death rate of about 1%, and variola major, with a death rate of 30%. Deep pitted scars are most visible on survivors' faces and affect 65 to 80% of them. So if you ever feel the symptoms described in this video, make sure to visit your doctor right away. If you want to see more content like this, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon. Make sure to watch our other videos in the Monkeypox series too to get all the information. See you in the next video.